New Artist Alert, David Sebastian, Korea Town's own is in the building with us. How you doing, sir? Man, thank you. Thank you for having me. It's great to have you here. Now, David Sebastian's video, duh, is currently available. Let's take a look. Just a real nigga looking for some real shit. Jazzy Jeff, nigga, I've been on my Will Smith. Cash rules, everything around me. Cream, get the money. Dollar, dollar bill shit. Huh. No support from the government for that shit. So I applied for the scholarship and get that shit. Man, I couldn't get the sponsorship. So I dropped that I had to be the hottest like shit. Duh. Word up, man. The Dove video, I like it. I like the visuals quite a bit. It's, it's colorful and animated. It almost feels like something Missy Elliott might have put out, you know, right, back right, in the day. What's right. the inspiration behind that? I mean, the initial thought was just where music is at right now, aesthetically. Everyone, like, I feel like we went through, like, this depression, like, this dark. Everyone was trying to be, like, introverted and just, like, dark. And I wanted to put out something that kind of expressed just my taste level for life and, and, and art. And, you know, I grew up, the thing that even got me wanting to be a rapper was Missy, was Buster, was that whole 90s culture, Diddy, shiny suits and shit, like, that, the glamorization of that. So I, I always said when I get into the position, where I can manifest that. I always wanted to do my own 21st century interpretation of that. Word up. Now you have another single that's about to come out, if I'm not mistaken, it's called Shit Got Real. Shit Just Got Real, yeah. Shit Just Got Real. Yeah, um, that record, man, like just hearing the beat, you would think it was like a turn up record, cause like it's heavy 808 driven uh, anti-pop. We actually produced Duh, he's like the in-house kind of music curator throughout anti-society. Um, and I just kind of wanted to really express how I feel, like living and in, in being a part of this generation. Like, shit is getting real. It hasn't, it hasn't got real because it hasn't, like, when you see, like, all these atrocities on, on the news of kids getting murdered by the police or people going, like, it affects us, but it's not, like, touching you yet. The second it touches you and it affects your family and your friends, and it, that's when shit really gets real. So this record is just more, like, talking directly to this generation, like, yo, this is what's going on. It's the fucking end of the world, like, fucking wake up. I'm a hitter in America, they treat us like feces. Fuck saving whales, hitters been endangered species. Yeah, yeah, I mean, <laughs> you know, I mean, not, not, I love whales, you know? <laughs> Free Willy, you know, <laughs> I feel you. Making that clear. Yeah, but like, we Peter. Are, you know, 100 days, 100 nights, you know, right now black people are like killing each other at a very rapid rate. My assistant just told me like three people died yesterday. That he knew, like, it's really crazy. And it's, it's just that if we don't do something about it, we will be an endangered species. It's an interesting song because again, there's a lot of political leaning, leaning commentary, but you haven't necessarily been someone who's talked about being a part of the political system. Like you never seem to, uh, you never seem to, you know, choose a Democrat or Republican as much as. I did, anti. Okay. Anti is my party. Okay. You know, I don't, I don't really, I, I feel at the end of the day, it's humanity. You know, you, you could pick a side, it's good, bad, evil, whatever the case may be. It's encouraging people to, to think for themselves, to not follow a party, to not follow a quote unquote leader, but to actually realize that they are the leader. They are the president of their life. So, you know, live accordingly. So is there value in voting, right? I mean, we're in an election cycle now, for example. I think 2012 was when Pussy Marijuana came out. That was an election cycle then. You know, I mean, look who's running, you know? I mean, I, I could get really deep on this, but I would just say that it's, everything is a show. You ever see the Truman Show? Yes. It's one of my favorite movies. This, this world, this country, like, it's, it's all fabricated, man. It's all fake. At the end of the day, I really don't feel like we have power because everything gets manipulated. And, and at the end of the day, what's going to happen is going to happen. Everything that has been happening has been pre-planned pre for, for, for decades, you know? It's just, at the end of the day, what are you going to do to, to say, you know what, I'm not going to follow the propaganda. I'm going to make my own decision. Now, does, is uh, Shit Just Got Real attached to a project? What's that event? Um, yeah, the project's called I Am Anti. I Am Anti is a, is a project that kind of has all these walls of sound. It's like cross-genre, multi-genre. It's, it's like, it's a hip-hop album, but... Actually, I don't even want to call it a hip-hop album because it's just, it's just different, man. I just wanted to create, me and my team just wanted to create something that had new sonics, new 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 themes new new lyrics to new just want to create a new world so favorite david sebastian quote for myself i had like eight brothers and sisters all of them were imaginary 
He did an interview called 15 Questions David Sebastian's Never Been Asked Before. <laughs> I just had to tell you that. What can people, uh, where can people uh, get in touch with you? How can they find your music? Um, David Sebastian, we live in the 21st century. If you want to find someone, you can find them. Like my Instagram is at David Sebastian Anti. No E's. That's the biggest mistake. Everyone puts E's. I think that's how you like spell it. But, um, <laughs> you know, uh, it's S A B A S T I A N. Um, but pretty much anywhere. Go to antisociety.com and there's a button that says join or ask. And like literally that goes straight to my email. I spend so much, I spend hours and hours a day talking to kids all over the world who, um, who want to join this movement, who want to be a part of this movement, who want to create, and who are eager and ready to to make their voice be heard. So literally, go to Anti, hit the join, and like I'm, that's me answering that. I, I wanted to make sure, because I could have other people do that, but I really wanted to be an integral part of talking to, to my fans. Word up, man. I'm a fan of the music. We've been working a couple of weeks to get this together. I'm, fine. I'm glad you finally got a chance to stop through. Great platform. Make it happen. Yeah, like, that's awesome that you guys give a platform to new up-and-coming artists who are really out here trying to make an impact. Up, man. We appreciate you, man. Those are today's most interesting hip-hop headlines. Agree with us, disagree with us, but let us know what you think about it in the comment section. I'm Justin Hunt, and as always, for more music and news, visit hiphopdx.com.